Welcome back to another episode of Harry Potter and the Prisoner of Azkaban. In uh, the last episode, we ended off right here, as you can see. This is where we ended off. Now, the next thing we're going to do is actually end the day right now. But first, we want to see who is in the lead. So right now, uh, this is Hufflepuff. Um, is 70 points. Gryffindor is 220 points. And then Ravenclaw is 116 points. And Slytherin is 200 points. So basically Slytherin is crawling right, right behind us, basically. So now we're going to go ahead and, uh, uh, end off the day. End the day. And I'm going to read each uh, description and try to um, <clears throat> try to keep up with the speed. With this with this uh, speech. Winter came to Hogwarts. The sky lightened to a dazzling opline White and the muddy grounds were hidden beneath the blanket of soft snow. Inside the castle there was a buzz of Christmas in the air, marred only by worries over Professor Snape's imitant potions class. Well, we've got the grab horn horn, but last time I checked we were still missing some other ingredients. We better go and find them before we go to Snape's class then. So it looks like a thing, so we will be going. Now, I'm actually going to read this. Now, the potion vial case. Now, the theory I'm hoping is that is that some people are saying that this is the, the time of the game that you get these doors unlocked. It's like all doors are locked. And I'm okay. So it looks like s that those doors right there are unlocked. So it's that one over there. So that's telling me something. <clears throat> we'll find out. That's only if these doors, though, are unlocked. And if they aren't, I'm going to the second floor to get this task done. And they are not. Look at this. Six floors unlocked. I mean locked, but man. That's locked. That's locked. This is where I want to go. That's where I want to go, but... <sighs> Fine. Anyway. Let me actually, <clears throat> let me search something here. I'm going to try to research something here. Just give me a minute, I'm just, I'm a little slow typer, so don't think I'm taking too much time.
her. Let's try that. Give me a minute, I'm just, I'm still searching. I'm just still searching, apparently. Hmm.
Yeah, this is just taking a lot of my time. Yeah, literally finding the answers to what I'm looking for is just going to waste my time. I want to get to the second floor. And that's really annoying. It really is. This is what um this is what I get, basically. Trying to get certain locations complete. <sighs> Fine. Alright, let's just cut to the chase and just get the potion ingredients. And then... And then once we are able to be done with the potions class. And then once we're done with that then the second floor will be available to us at this at, at that point so yeah basically this is how this is how annoyed I am right now that I have to do the actual entire game in order to unlock each floor and get everything. Literally. And I said, this is a 100% walkthrough, but how does one actually get a certain item that that they're looking for but have no access at that point. It's like, what's up with that? Like, really, what's up with that? I literally just don't understand. If somebody is watching this right now, leave in the comments Tell me exactly step by step of how to unlock every door in this grand staircase. 
and what I need to do in order to get those each door to be unlocked so I can go on to each floor. So, if you can do that for me, that would save me a ton. Literally, that would be saving me a ton to actually find what I'm looking for. I got a potion vial. Sweet. Another bean. Alright, so where am I going? I'm just that paranoid. As you can tell, I'm that paranoid. Like, I'm trying my any, I'm trying my best at any way possible to actually unlock every door. What do I need to do? And what steps do I need to take in order to unlock every door so I can go in through each floor just to get what I want? I mean, I mean, I literally am thinking, like, what do I need to do? Like, I'm just that, I'm just that paranoid. Like, what do I need to do? Somebody tell me. So if you're watching this, leave in the comments below and tell me step by step of how to unlock every door at the Grand Staircase. It seems like when I'm trying to do an actual certain task, it only unlocks the only current door that allows you to go into it. But again, I want every door to be unlocked. How does one actually unlock a door that they want to go into? Literally, the sixth floor is what I want. But in order to get to that, how does one get to it? That's what I want to find out. Because there is a, a chest that I do want to unlock on the fifth floor, and I have not figured out what, what, it, what it was, and I still haven't found out what it was to this day. So, how does one actually get that chest open? So yeah, in case you're wondering why I'm that paranoid, I literally am, like, no joke. That's one right there. 
Now let's go ahead and get this guy right here. <coughs> Okay, so now that's done. Now it took care of the easy ones. I'm going to switch to Hermione here. Now I am going to go and run. To Buckbeak here. We're going to go ahead and bow, take him down. Alright, so now we're going to go ahead and have Buckbeak do the rest here. Okay, so we need only one more ingredient. That's it. Did that all in one go. I like that. Now I have all the potion ingredients, which is good. thing is left to do is now go ahead go to the potions and learn about antidote of uncommon poisons antidote to uncommon poisons basically is a, a healer of for poisons but it doesn't heal your health so you want to be very cautious of that Another bean. Let's go ahead and go over here to this right here. Bing. Need the bean. We're at 66 beans right now. Now, after uh, the potions class, uh, the second floor will be available to us. I think. Not sure. I think. If that's the case. So in here, um, I did get stopped, basically, because there was a a glitch in the game um not right here but th at the uh the next challenge that's up up ahead basically because the next challenge ahead i want to be very 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 careful because however that what lies ahead it's just that i have to be hermione the entire time and and the only problem is is that um, that my assistants 
or my um, actual allies, or friends, I should say. All right, so we'll get to that in a little later. We have a lesson to deal with. And as you can see, combined to form the antidote to uncommon poisons, which can be administered to cure such things as venomous of a venomous bite of a doxa. Now, I would like you to gather the f gather together the following greens in time for our next lesson: flying seahorses, doxy eggs, toasted dragonflies, thoraxes, and fairy wings. We are. We will be using the, these ingredients to make the girding potion. Claus dismissed. All right. <clears throat> I personally don't like Snape. For him to, uh, man, I don't know. I have ancient ruins next. You two go to charms, and I'll meet you there. What's what's she on about? Good question, actually. Kind of wondering <coughs> how she's getting around so quickly. I'm kind of questioning that myself. How is she getting around to every class? That's... How is she getting around and being at all the classes at the same time? Like, in the movie, of uh, the actual movie, she has like three classes at the same time. Like 9 a.m., three of them. And how she does it, don't know. I don't know how she does it. So, now we're going to charms. Now... This second floor is now available to us, like I said it was going to be. Now, this is a chance to get this item. Hmm. Now, if second floor is the only one that's unlocked, I'll be so mad. Yep, so this one's locked. Yep, see, this is the only door that's unlocked. Now, I hope the next item is not on a floor. That would be so annoying. So, before we get to the charms, though, we are going to collect uh, this item, however. This potion vial should be no further than a little bit further away from the potions class, which, um, should be around here somewhere. I'm not going to the, the, the charms class, right there. So we're going to go ahead and collect that. Boom. Now let's bring this to the notice board, and hopefully it's a floor that I have an access, uh, have available access to. So that's the only theory I have. I'm hoping that's the only theory I've got. That if if the next location is where I am available to, or available to go to without being seen, that would be awesome. So that's the only hope I have. Because <laughs> I'm still trying to unlock that door right there. Because, however... There is, there's things that I do want to buy, and, and this game is very lenient of where I need to go, and it's that annoying. It really is, actually, now that I think about it, yeah. So, so, what I'm going to do is go to... Right through here. <coughs> and go see Sir Kadogan.
but Sir Cadogan can be very annoying of how he talks. So annoying. So don't take it too personal. And you're not the only one that has to listen to him. Trust me. I have to. Every time I want to come in here. That's why I try to avoid talking to the guy. Because he's so annoying. So we awarded 10 house points. Now what's next? A pair of dragon hide gloves last seen in the defense against the Dark Arts class. Room, if found, please return this to the notice board. <clears throat> Alright. There has to be a way of getting to the third floor. Hmm. <clears throat> I'm just kind of thinking. What do I have to go to to go to the next floor? Like, I am I will be able to go to the fourth floor from this floor here that I'm on now. But getting to the third floor from there, there's no chances. No chances at all. There's nothing that can lead to the third floor from there. There's a passage that leads to the second floor. So, therefore, there's no secret passage that would lead to third floor, unless I'm thinking it wrong. So, now this is where I got stuck in this uh, challenge that, it, that, we're, that we're heading to now. Um, um, let's just hope that I don't get, uh, really, really, man, <clears throat> now I might have to do this in the next level. Or the next episode. So I'm going to go ahead and start it. But. I'm only going to do. Let's see how long it takes to get us into the challenge. Let's see how long it takes. So starting at this point. Right now. Starting now. Let's see how long it takes. <clears throat> to actually start the challenge. Let's see how long it takes. <clears throat> Which is why the Carpe Retractum spell is useful. It allows you to seize and pull objects toward directly your line of sight. Sorry. Yeah. Miss Granger, would you be so kind to bring Harry and Ron to the front with you? It's your turn to retrieve the Carpe Retractum spellbook. Sweet. This is where I got stuck the last time. Because I only defeated, like I said, I only defeated one Doxy and two of the uh, Red Caps. So, um, <clears throat> I didn't even, I did not even move, and that, that has been activated. Alright, well, it looks like we might have to do the challenge here. Alright, here we go. Mm. Ron, or Harry, out of my way. Oh, see, if you were not in the way, you wouldn't be able to...
All right, so that is done. Oh, we're not even done. Dang. All right. <clears throat> so now that's taken care of. Now, before we actually do move on, I don't want to waste any more time. So I'm actually now actually starting this challenge. But I don't want to go any further. Because I don't want to spoil anything up ahead just yet. Okay? So, now, if you like this video, please hit that like button below. And also, uh... Also comment and tell me what can I do about the locked doors on each floor and what do I have to do in order to get each door unlocked in order for me to go on each floor. So if you can do that for me, that will be sweet. I'm your host, Survival Man 1, and I'll catch you guys in the next episode of Harry Potter and the Prisoner of Azkaban, see ya.